Hey cuties, what's up, what's up, what's up? I am so excited, I am back with this unit. Ladies, this is a gorgeous unit. This unit is very, very reasonable for the way that it looks, in my opinion. Um, let me just say, I hope you're having a beautiful day or night when you're watching this. So let's just jump right in, okay? <laughs> so this is Cloud9 Swiss Lace, 100% hand braided lace wig so they hand braided this wig and it's gorgeous and one second i will show you that and this is 100 percent cankaline hair which is like braiding hair they use for your you know when you get your tizillions or you know you know hair like that and this is a extra large lace parting area um, so it has the um, 13 by 5 right in here where you get all the lace and things like that. So gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, this I have it in the color 1. And I think she has on a 1 too. It looks gorgeous. This color 1 is so bold. It's so daring. I really love that it's like pitch black like this because it brings out the braids more in my opinion. Um, so let's talk about it. Let me get close up on it. So um, I did put a little bit of powder on it. But to me, in my opinion, um, you don't need powder because the the lace is brown. But if you, if you want to go in with some, it, you know, it will look probably nice. But to me, mine didn't look too good in pictures so when i took the powder off i wiped it off with a makeup uh sponge um a makeup rag and then the pictures look much better because the powder was just doing too much i do have a black cap under this so um though i did have a tan cap under this and it was just too loud it just brought up like my scalp look almost like uh white or something so i don't suggest a, a cap uh, a tan cap unless you're like fair skin um, I would say a dark cap uh, like a dark brown cap for like people in my complexion and darker or um, just a black cap so here are the braids close up um, the baby hairs I cut really short because they did come as you can see this piece I didn't cut this piece off it's really short right here um, the lace comes from ear to ear it is soft lace and the wig is pretty sturdy without adding um, they got to be glued on it but if you feel like you want to add it at the edge you can but most of that baby hair is going to disguise that lace if you lay it like this so you don't need um you don't need got to be glued if you don't want to it's the the cap is secure the cap is a little bit small in my opinion um so if you have a bigger head, you may want to just leave the latches alone because it fits snug so that the braids can kind of lay back on its own. Um, I really do love this wig. Um, it's about, uh, I would say, 22 inches long. The braids are really sealed nicely. So it's braided and then it's kind of like twisted at the end to make sure that the ends are locked. I just love this. Let me give you a 360. So, as you can see in the back, um there are no filler hairs. I like the way that they added the hair and the tracks closely together so you won't really have any like space, you know, um, no gaps or whatever. Um, this is a unit that is just one of a kind to me. They have the braided units online and on Instagram from the different shops, but this is just one alternative if you just don't want to wait for like three weeks to get your braid from oh you know your braids from um nigeria although i do have one coming in the mail and look out for that review um i forgot the company name but i'll you know look you know list everything once i do the video but yeah um i guess you can like do this hair 
in a ponytail. My arm is still kind of, this is the bad arm. I got my, my splint off, but you can kind of put it up like this and kind of wear it like that. But I'm sorry, ladies. I can't really do too much with this arm. But I did want to share with you guys. Um, the the hair is a bit like lustery. It has a bit of a shine to it, but it's not overbearing. It looks like you, if your hair is dry when you get it braided, it doesn't look good. It looks dry and you know like it hasn't been done. But this has a sheen to it, and it's just perfect, perfect, perfect to me. Um, I paid one fifteen for this hair, um, cause um, Ebony Line had to save five, save ten, and save twenty. You could pick which one you wanted to save off of, and um, I picked the twenty, of course. So um, yeah, my wig was only one fifteen, and I think they have it on wig types, but they're sold out on the wig types. I know a lot of people are not messing with um ebony line so i would say just um you know if you're going to purchase from ebony line you need to call first make sure they have it in stock before you you know spend your money on it because you don't want to spend your money then you have to wait to be refunded and you don't get your wig that's not good so i always call first this time i didn't because they had a lot in stock so i just went ahead and purchased it but yes, yes. <laughs> and out of this one in the goddess locks, you know, comment down below. Let me know which one you think looks better on me. Let me know which one you want to try and everything like that. Um, the lace is soft. The cap is um, the cap is medium to small. The braids are so nice. They're really small. They look so so pretty. Like I'm just loving this. It makes you look like a different person, like, when you have this on. It makes you look so, like, pretty. <laughs> it enhances your, you know, your beauty for sure. But um, that's all, ladies, for this review. And I appreciate you for welcome, you know, watching my channel, for, you know, staying true to my channel, even though I have been missing for um, some months. And I really appreciate you guys. You know, my, my channel is growing. And I'm really, really proud of myself. It's growing, but it could grow more. But, you know, that's up to you guys. <laughs> and um, thank you so much again. And I'm out of here. Try this wig, ladies. It's cute. It's cute, cute, cute. <laughs>